Hello everyone, welcome back to High Mathematics. Today we have an interesting limit. What is the limit as x approaches to infinity of the function x times 2 to the power 1 over x minus 1? So first of all we need to plug in this infinity right here. So what we will have? If x approaches to infinity, this x approaches to infinity as well. So we will have infinity times, and in parentheses we will have 1 over infinity goes to 0. So we will have 2 to the 0 power minus 1. This will be equal to zero. So we will have infinity over zero, which is of course undefined, so we don't know what the value that represent. So what we're going to do next? Let's simplify our expression right here. So I want to suggest you a little bit trick. First of all we can write this x in our denominator, but not x, 1 over x. We will have the limit as x approaches to infinity of the function. This leave right here, so we will have 2 to the power 1 over x minus 1, and this x I write in our denominator 1 over x. So if you divide in this we will have the same as right here, so nothing change. But as you can see this is a really good case to use a L'Hopital's rule because we will have an undefined answer 0 over 0. So this is equal to, let's use L'Hopital's rule right here, so we will have derivative from our nominator over derivative from our denominator. So we will have that this limit will be equal to limit as x approaches to infinity of the derivative from our nominator d dx from our nominator to to the power 1 over x minus 1 over derivative d dx from our 1 over x. So let's find these derivatives. First of all, let's find derivative from our nominator. So this will be equal to limit as x approaches to infinity Let's find derivative. First of all, derivative of 2 to the power 1 over x. We know that 2 to the power x is equal to 2 to the power x natural log 2, but right here we have 2 to the power 1 over x. So this will be equal to 2 to the power 1 over x natural log 2, and we need to multiply this by derivative from our 1 over x because of the chain rule. Derivative of our 1 over x will be minus 1 over x squared. And this is our derivative from this one. Right here the derivative will be 0, so we go to our denominator. What we'll have in our denominator? We'll have a table case. Derivative from our 1 over x will be minus 1 over x squared. And as you can see we can cancel this expression and this expression. So as a result we will have a really good case that this limit will be equal to limit as x approaches to infinity of the function 2 to the power 1 over x times natural log 2. And as you can see, if we plug in infinity right here, this 1 over x goes to 0. If you plug in infinity, we will have 1 over infinity. And if we raise in 2 to the 0 power, we will have 1. And we we'll leave only our natural log 2. So our limit is equal to natural log. If you have any question, if you have any suggestion, maybe you have faster method how to solve it, write a suggestion in comment, write a question in the comment. Thank you for watching, subscribing, and see you in the next videos.